Chukwe Ekwakwe can't contain his anger. A judicial panel has just awarded him 7.5 million naira after finding that members of a notorious Nigerian police unit had tortured him. That's 18,000 US dollars after an incident he says left him paralyzed from the waist down. No charges have ever been brought against him. The dead five-year-old has gone from supporting his family to relying on his mother to dress him and change his diapers and his sisters for handouts. That money, no joking, you know? that money is not enough. It is not enough. My, My two sisters spent more than 30 million naira. So what is 7.5 million? Ekwakwe accuses the officers from the now disbanded Special anti robbery Squad, or SAS, of throwing him from his second floor balcony. The officer in charge of the 2018 raid claimed he jumped and told the panel officers were acting on information Ekweke was handling stolen goods. The panel concluded Ekweke was stabbed and beaten in police custody. It has no power to bring charges, but recommended that police carry out their own inquiry. Lagos State Police did not respond to requests for comment. Ekweke's case is one of more than 2,000 being heard across Nigeria. Such investigations were a core demand of the thousands of Nigerians who took to the streets calling for an end to SARS in October. But six months later, and many say they are still waiting for justice. Rino Odola is one of the two activists invited to join the Lagos panel, but she left after four months calling it a sham. She says hearings have been slow, officers accused of carrying out abuses go unpunished, and some victims complain of inadequate compensation. They've been frustrated to the extent that most of them have lost interest in the case. Most of these victims have spent millions in lawsuits. A Minister of Justice spokesman said it supported the panels. Back at this hearing, Ekwakwe is persuaded to collect his check from a panel chair, Doris Okwobu. To you, it may be small, but you must bear one thing in mind that justice has been done to your case. But for a quackwe, this is not justice.